This is going to be a quick discussion video about the latest chapter of Shingeki no Kyojin. It will contain some major spoilers, so you have been warned. In chapter 99, there are two phrases in particular that I think are extremely difficult to translate from Japanese. So I want to hear your opinions on how to translate these phrases into English or any other language you speak. The first phrase, Yamashiki Kage. This is the title of chapter 99 in the official translation by Kodansha. This phrase is translated as guilty shadow. In an unofficial translation on manga stream, the same phrase is translated as a shadow of guilt. The second translation sounds better, but neither feels quite right to me. First of all, feeling guilty and being guilty are two completely different things. The adjective yamashi describes a guilty conscience, which is a feeling of guilt. And the use of this adjective does not necessarily imply that you are actually guilty of something. However, the English adjective guilty is ambiguous as to whether it describes a feeling of guilt or the state of being guilty. The word yamashi also derives from the word yamu, which means to become sick, whereas the English word guilt comes from the old English word guilt or however you want to pronounce it. And this word meant crime or offense. So yamashi and guilty have very different connotations. How would you translate this sentence if you were the translator? The second phrase this phrase appears as a caption on the very last page of this chapter. In the official translation by Kodansha, this phrase seems to be translated as Here is a man who fights for freedom. The original Japanese phrase does not say anything about Eren's purpose for his rebellion. So, fight for freedom is a mistranslation. On the other hand, in the unofficial translation of Manga Stream, this phrase is translated as The man willing to fight, injured or not, is right here. Again, I prefer the unofficial translation, and this translation is quite close to the meaning intended by Isayama, but neither of these translations is perfect, nor is my translation that I suggested as a joke on Reddit. Let's analyze the constituents of this phrase. The first word, fujiu ni, is an adverb, which comes from the adjective fujiu na. Fujiu usually means either not free or physically disabled. The second word, aragao, is a verb that means to rebel against. The third word, mono, means one who, and the last phrase, koko ni ari, means is here. Now, the problem is the first word, namely, fujiu ni. Given Eren's guise as an amputee, it seems likely that fujiu ni in this phrase implies that the rebel in question cannot move as freely as he wants. However, I am not aware of any adverb in English that expresses the manner in which a disabled person engages in a rebellious activity. And the combination fujiu ni and aragao in Japanese is also extremely uncommon. What is the adverb for the word disabled? What is your opinion? Let me know in the comment section below.